Hello and welcome back to Snow and Air Season 14 and today we are on a recovery mission as I lost one of the Earth Rumours skating and didn't have autonomous so I thought I'd give it an excuse to get the feet on tractor and got the extra weights on it so we've got plenty oh we should have plenty of power I've got the extra winch on it as well so we're going to give it a go to see if it's any good at recovering so the earth runner isn't too far away it's all tarmac all the way it is a little bit slidey on these tires but it's not that bad now I didn't have a go with a free time with the twin tires and it's like what is the point of that you try and get those twin tires down some of the little tracks and whatever and it just wouldn't go anywhere it's, uh, I was going to do a video on it but I'll tell you what it pissed me off that much I was like no <laughs> what's the point why do you need those white wider tires only good if you on the main roads right there you go but I've got the top engine and the special gearbox for this bad boy. So we shouldn't have any trouble. You see, we've got the weights on the back, we've got the weights on the front there. Oh, hang on. there we go. So we have got the, I think it was the advanced. Right, here we go. This is the issue. Now I didn't realise. I do like the way they've done these crumbling roads. It's really, really good. But I think we need to be on the other side. Now I wonder if we can get through there with a winch. Because it will get winched onto there. Shall we risk it? Because that's gonna... Oh shit, we just lost the winch now. Let's winch to that one. You might be able to get away with it. Oh my god. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's right, we're down here. Or is that right? Really, we can do good up there a bit. Oh, all your drive. Oh, you just really feel. Yeah. I'm worried that as soon as I get the front off there, we're going to uh, lose it. So yes, already screwed this up, haven't I? Uh, well, we could just drag that trailer out the way. We're going to have to get down there now. It looks like we might be able to find that that way, but I think that front weight is going to um, really screw me up. It's quite low. Well, now there is no snorkel for this either. I'll tell you what, that this lock always engaged. No. This is the right. This is the better engine as well, so I expected this to yeah, get the job done, no problems. Right. That doesn't seem to be the case. That front weight. Well, let's drag the trailer out the way first. Yeah, we get that on the back there. And if we drag. Oh that out the way. We might be able to climb. Okay. That's not going to put the tray there. Oh it is. Winch it towards us a little bit more. Uh, really, I probably should have brought something to get rid of now it's going to block it in, we've got to get right. Hopefully. Steering is not great. But we might be able to manage it just a bit. Probably the bottom now. So probably not the best tool for the job, but you would have thought so. I think that water's not that deep. I'm getting so stuck. 
Unbelievable. Come on. Alright, let's get into the water. Is it off? I think it's because of the lack of suspension. So it doesn't want to go like, over rock at all. But no snowfall for this. I'm not sure how deep we can go. But I'm pretty deep there. I feel we need to see that was ridiculous, isn't it? Absolutely bloody ridiculous. Strong like that. It seems to be these tyres. I I've tried that one car, they all said the same sort of rotation, but how the hell are we getting up there? It's not going up there, is it? No way. Might be able to get the winch into play on one of the trees up there and pull us up, but it doesn't even want to go straight. Let's try and get a winch up there now if it's close enough. No, it's not. We don't want a winch to the earth rover. Bloody hell. Come on, give me this lock. Get it up there. No, it's going to grind out on that bottom bit, isn't it? But we might be a little bit closer now to attach a winch. We've got a winch point there. Let's just get on that one. Power. No, it's just going to break that way. What a load of shite. So this is not the best thing to use, is it? I thought you would be able to give it a quick little spin with it, but what a piece of shit. Right, let's go and get rid of that front weight. And we are back. So got rid of the weight. Got some bigger tyres, the Jack Wall Trades tyres, and I think we might as well go around the other side. Because if we go down there, we're going to get stuck again. And it doesn't like rocks, it doesn't like anything. On the road, it's beautiful. Just goes along, no problem. Give me a little bit of sliding around, but it's not too bad. Let's go and take it off road here. And we're in all-wheel drive, no diff on at the moment. Yeah, see if we had that weight on, that would have just grind out there, so... Diff locks. Come on. Is the top engine there? It still... Needs a little bit more power. See those wheels sometimes they're sort of not... Well, they don't feel like they want to get the job done. And it's just slipping slightly. I'm oh, not too bad now. Like, is it my eyes playing up? That's a pretty cool bridge. If only you can make stuff like that on the But that's to come on road fast. That's pretty cool. I like this. Oh, this takes some time to the other side anyway. Oh. Yeah. Bit of damage. So there is long collision on that front bumper. But otherwise you wouldn't get it anyway. Like we we're always gonna just go straight off that way. Let's go right. Oh shit. The pattern for your okay. What's high gear like? Okay. I've got a bit of get up and go. You can see the steering is just terrible. You know, you'd have thought you could turn around there to just the old go. I thought, I wonder if 
still changes to these tires. Yeah. It didn't seem that bad, it was a little bit bad, but not too bad. Right, so what we will do is have a little road down there, but so we just drove along and just find the straight out of. That's why you should always survey the area around you. But never mind, it's an advantage to have road night. And this one is going to go up to the next map. Uh, hopefully, now we can uh, drag it out without any issues. Right, what does that look like from in cab? Oh, you can't even turn all the way around. Oh, we don't need to. Right, so we pull this bad boy out. I'll tell you what, let's put the winch on. Probably not a good idea. Get out of there. Let's see what's going on. And yeah, that's not a problem. Um, what is a problem though? Is I should have touched it on the front as well. I'm not going to pull it out, is it? We're going to have to let it roll back in. We need it on that front. Touch winch straight on the front there. And then that should just should. Yeah, you just winch that up. Oh that winch is working a treat. Mind you it is only a skate. Whoa. The clock's on. Struggling. Well, I'll tell you what might be better. Turn on engine of a winch vehicle. We get a bit closer to it. It's sort of lifted up a little bit more. There we go. Beautiful. Whoa. Oh, yeah. So it can be used for the recovery. That's pretty good. I like that. Get into high gear. That high gear is pretty bad. And this takes us up to the next map. Backdrop on this beautiful. Really are. We've got two passes on this map. I haven't been to the other map yet. We will get there. Okay, we will leave it there for today. I hope you enjoyed this first look at, or second look really, of the Team Season 14 new vehicle, truck. And you can see what a pain in the ass it is, without any suspension. But, there you go. Thanks for watching, hit the likes on the way out, and I will see you.